dress. But it itches. Everything itches. I know it does, honey, but it'll be over soon. And just one step at a time, okay? Maybe this will teach you to stop doing what you're doing and learn your lesson. Hello. I'm Joyce Millhouse. Dr. Cleaver's on vacation in the Pocono, so I'm going to be taking care of you today. Can we just wait till Dr. Cleaver comes back? He already knows about. No, what? We can't. That Cass has been driving me crazy. I see we have a couple of concurrent injuries. Mom, I am not comfortable with this. Come on, Doc. Here to help. <laughs> Would you take his vitals, Elsie? Accident. <laughs> um, don't ask me for details. He's very shy and he will not tell me anything. Mm -hmm. Don't know why. Um, apparently, there was a um, gear shift, a wobbly gear shift involved in a car, in a car that was moving that moved him right into the side of a tree at the very worst possible moment. <laughs> all the time. Yes. <laughs> You'd be surprised at how often. Yeah, these days, if it doesn't involve auto asphyxiation, I'm happy. <laughs> he has an itch. Oh, all over. I can help with that. <laughs> oh, man's oh, oh, mental retardment. Oh, God. It doesn't seem very comfortable with this. I'm not. Mom. This is embarrassing. Max, you're so here. We're all professionals. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Professional. You know, I know it's it's very awkward to talk about the totally normal habit of Does he have a little name for it? <laughs> I do know. <laughs> he used to call it spanking the monkey. <laughs> <laughs> but that was a really long time ago. But. I grew so fast. I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, anyway, I I think we should play it safe with the hand. You know, we leave, leave it in the sling a couple more days, but the sling can go. Fantastic. <laughs>